What's happening, Big 12 fans? Mitch Gerber from the Big 12 Digital Network, and I've got good news for you today. The sun came out, just like I asked for. The bad news? There was none of that here on semifinal Saturday in Stillwater, Oklahoma. Just after 12 p.m. Central Time, the men got us tipped off with doubles play, and it was Texas Tech's bottom of their lineup who came through for them today as the Red Raiders collected a 4-3 victory to move on to tomorrow's championship. Yeah, I mean, the bottom of the lineup, that's our, been our strength, you know, beginning of the year, majority of the year, and they came out and give us three points and puts the pressure on them. And, uh, you know, uh, Fran uh, pointed out in there that, you know, Felipe and Hugo, they did a great job competing there, losing the first sets, tough first sets, emotional, and then they came back and got back in, the, you know, in, in the match with the second sets and gave us a chance to win on both courts. Um, you know, and so, yeah, it just gives other guys the chance to, you know, feel like they can get, you know, get back in the match when we have, so, you know, be, when we're solid like that from four through six. And those guys did a great job today, getting on the, getting off the court and getting us some wins. Texas Tech will take on the TCU Horn Frogs, who collected a 42 victory over the Oklahoma Sooners earlier in the day. Tech and TCU will square off for the second time this month, with the last meeting coming back on April 24th. As things geared towards women's play here this afternoon, it was Oklahoma State taking on the Kansas Jayhawks. The Cowgirls came out and owned their home court advantage. I mean, Kansas had a great season. They played a great match yesterday against Baylor, so we didn't take them lightly. They played us really tough last Sunday, but I'm really proud of our girls. We had the opportunity to get off the court quick today, and we jumped on that and took advantage of it. And I believe we're going to be fresh and ready for a final tomorrow. Just on the other side of the complex here this afternoon, it was Texas Tech taking on the TCU Horn Frogs. This one was all Red Raiders as they walked away with a 4-1 victory and are moving on to tomorrow's championship match. Don't forget that tomorrow's women's championship match can be found live on FS2, but if that doesn't work for you, slide your way on over to Big12Sports.com for plenty of post-game reaction. For the Big 12 Digital Network, I'm Mitch Gerber.